hard to imagine any future where we don't have digital tools. Mobile devices have reached a, a level of usability and market penetration that is completely unprecedented. It's as big as the Enlightenment or the Renaissance. This is the first democratic digital computer that could go to every single human. That is unimaginably huge. Most of the great breakthroughs come from smaller software companies. It's been said a few times today. They don't come from the large software companies. We had only been programming for eight or nine months and we had built a mobile app. We weren't millionaires overnight, but it was like this might actually sustain itself. We decided that we would start a business together and create an app together. My friend came to me and said, why don't we just make apps? Yeah. The switch had fully flipped in my mind. I was on top of the world. Nothing was going to stop us. Like, this is going to be incredible. Good morning. We're programming the devices to extract value from people in any way we can. People end up getting sucked into things that are explicitly designed to suck them in. There's nothing more sobering than opening up the top grossing in the iOS app store. It is 99% cash dump games. Juicy. Now I reached out to, I don't know, 20, 30, 40 investors at this point. I've had hundreds of thousands of customers. And even with that, it was impossible to sustain the business. I'm gonna kill myself now. The dream was over. I woke up. <laughs> oh. It's crazy to think about a world that existed before software. Yeah, okay, Here's to the crazy one. I don't understand how people got things done. Misfits, rebels. It seems really harsh to say that Apple is losing part of its soul, but I think, yeah, in a way. How much value we place on people, humanity, individuals, and software. That is truly what's going to determine whether we have a fighting chance. Thank you, guys. Okay. A lot of things have changed, but values and core values, those things shouldn't change. I have faith that humanity will make the right decisions. We're going to figure out how to bend materials to our will and shape them into things that are going to make our lives better. Because the people who are crazy enough to think they can change the world 